What's good everyone? Today we're going to talk about how John Morant just parted ways with his childhood best friend, Devontae Pack, also known as DTAP, as John Morant just unfollowed him on all social media platforms. Now I know unfollowing someone on Instagram might not mean much to you guys, but let me tell you guys all the reasons why this is a huge deal. John and Devontae were best friends growing up that did everything together, and Devontae even lived with John Morant when John made the NBA. It is clear that there is some beef going on between them, as Devontae Pack's Instagram used to be flooded with posts with John Moran, and now he deleted most of his posts associated with John. DTAP and John Moran also own a clothing line together called MBA No Brand, which stood for My Brothers No Others, which John has tatted on him. And John Moran also unfollowed that account, and it also seems like he unfollowed most of his friends that he grew up with and that he would always hang around. And I honestly think this is a great decision for John, as his friends clearly weren't good influences on him. As during this whole past year where all these allegations made against John Moran happened, he was with his best friend Devontae Pack and all of them. I mean, if you look back, Devontae Pack, aka DTAP, was with Ja during the time he beat up a teenager and flashed a gun at him last summer. Also, that finish line mall incident where they threatened to beat up a finish line worker with Ja, DTAP, and seven other friends, and how they shoved and threatened mall security after that incident. We also have the incident where DTAP was sitting courtside at the Indiana Pacers game and he got into it with some of the players which led him to get kicked out of the arena. And after the game, DTAP and Ja allegedly pointed a red laser beam from a gun at the Indiana Pacers team bus after the game. And obviously we had the two incidents where Ja pulls out a gun on Instagram Live, with his most recent incident being on his best friend DTAP's Live, where he gets caught pulling out a gun. So it's safe to say that Ja was clearly hanging around the wrong group of guys, and has gotten himself in serious trouble as he may get suspended for the whole season next year, costing him millions of dollars. So yes, the fact that John Morant unfollowed his best friend T-Tap from all social media accounts and many of his other friends I think is a big deal, and I think this means that he will cut ties with all of his friends who are bad influences, and hopefully now he can stay on the right track, as he is one of the most exciting players to watch in the NBA, with the potential to be a generational player. Now I am not saying that his friends are 100% reason why Ja has been getting in trouble. At the end of the day, it is John Morant making the decisions, but having better people around you will definitely help with making better decisions. I was worried, and I am still pretty worried, that John Morant's off-court decisions would cost him his NBA career, but this is a huge step for him that most people don't realize, and many of the major social media outlets aren't even talking about this right now. Literally everyone has been begging Ja to hang around different people, and to make better decisions off the court, and hopefully he is finally making the right steps to being a better person off the court. Comment down below if you guys think this is a big deal, and if you think Ja is going to stop getting in trouble after cutting ties with his best friend. Thank you for watching and make sure y'all go like and subscribe as this is a new and upcoming channel.